All right, you guys. So if you saw last episode, you know, hi, you know, we're going to go get that Yanma or at least a t Oh, there's another one. Yanma's everywhere. We're going to go after Yanma, try to catch a Yanma, and then we'll go toward the story quest, which is over there. But again, right now, my mind belongs to Yanma. My heart belongs to Volo. My asshole belongs to Adaman. And my cock and balls, they belong to me because you got you to gotta keep a little bit to yourself. A little bit of mystery. Um... Let's see, let's see if I can hide. And then let's sneak, he, and he's a little buzzy dragonfly. I feel like he's gonna be hard to sneak up on, especially with those big old goggle eyes. Now I'm afraid sneaking up on this one that the other one's gonna see me. And then I'm gonna lose my chance at it if I fuck this, please be mine, if I fuck this one up. <gasps> I got a Yanma, we're putting him on the team in a minute. Um, is he a grass and bug type? Yeah. Do I already have a grass and bug type? Yeah, maybe I'll replace my current grass and bug type with it. Or maybe I won't. Because strategy doesn't belong, doesn't exist on this channel. So if you're looking for strategy, intelligence, and decency, go somewhere else. Alright. But if you're looking for Yanma, story progress, and bad things, I don't know, I couldn't think of another thing to say. You've come to the right place. Welcome to youtube.com slash I don't have a vanity URL yet, so it's a bunch of letters and numbers. And uh, here we have a good time at the chagrin of those who believe intelligence and talent hold value. Okay, I need to be quiet. Let's go. What is that? That's just a rock. That's a plant. What is that in the water? That's a frog. Hey, I'm gonna leave you alone. You're just taking your little mud bath. Don't mind me. Is that a rift over there? I think it is. Oh, that's a geodude. Hey, bud. Um, I don't really need to fight you right now. I think there's like, do you see those colors in the sky? I think that's like a rift over there. Maybe we'll investigate it, but not right away. Let's do a little bit of story progress. I didn't get much done last time. Hey, you guys. Again, I have a full Pokedex entry for... Ooh, Hippopotas. Hippopat... Potash. Potash. What is potash, you guys? I loved that. Oh, that's kind of cute. Do you want to fight or do you want to be my friend? He wants to fight. I must be on my way. When I grind, you might see me like passing things like that and like fights with Geodudes and like that's EXP. When I. When I grind on my own, I'll do stuff like that. I do a little bit here so you guys can see me do it. But, like, when I'm- Oh, my fucking god. He's very upset that I threw a ball at his children. I apologize. Hello, sir. I'm talking very close to the mic today. I might be hurting you. And welcome to my channel where I hurt you actively. Knowingly and purposefully. Stay. Hello there. So you're the Survey Corps child who quelled the Lord of the Woods, are you? Think you could help us setting up our new base camp? We're making up one up by the bogs. Our, our Odo could sure use someone as capable as you. He's still a fresh construction corps recruit, still learning the ropes. I would like to build another camp. How do I help him? Does he need logs? Go help set up the camp. We might do that later. I'm going to assume it's up this hill, which I will not remember how to get to later. Oh god, there there's the distortion. Um, oh, I want to go here. Me and the old lady get along now. If you saw the last episode, you know that. Um, over here, Sia. Friends. Friends for life, her and I. I helped her learn how to read the Bible, actually. Ursa Luna is enraged, yes, but he must still recall his long relationship with the Pearl Clan. He never fails to show up the moment I... Oh, don't call him yet! I'm not ready! I think my, one of my Pokemon's passed out. Let's not do this right now. Mm -mm. Put that away! Ma'am. You and your fuck-ass Bob, sh I swear to God, sh shut up! Shut up! What are you doing?! I don't have time for that. Oh my god. Oh, it's like an Ursa ring. Because remember the other one was like a Scizor or a Scyther? I remembered his name, Scizor. Um, I couldn't remember Scyther's evolution's name last time. Okay, so this is... Oh, Ursa Luna. <laughs> it all makes sense. Now, show your medal to Ursa... I'm not ready, but remember that Ursa Luna is a Pokemon very... Also, he's not glowing. Is he really ravaging? Is he a problem right now? is a Pokemon very dear to the Pearl Clan. I will not permit you to catch him. I'm not trying to catch him. Hey, I'm not ready for this. Y'all couldn't warn me. 
I am in, no look at me, low on health. No, baby doll, so what am I doing? I'm just fighting Ursaluna? What's my purpose here? Okay, well, I'm gonna fight this thing. Um, X, this is not useful at all. Is he, is he ground type? Because if so, he's going to hand me my own ass, because Porygon's dying, and Dartrix is probably either dead or dying. Or will just die upon impact with... Is he ice type as well? Oh, it says ice right there. Hmm, very interesting. Um, Well, the gra... He's fainted, and I don't have any... This game is very mean. Well, I'm probably not going to make it out of this battle alive, but you know what? <sighs> Cricketune's not a good idea, because he's bug type. I, I feel like bugs and ice don't go together. Bird, maybe, but let's see. If you know typing and you're screaming at me, choke yourself. Um, and like, not in a good way. Um, just kidding. That's, I'm sorry. I make so many things sexual and it's so not necessary. 75, 60. Okay, well, definitely strong style because I've got to kick ass and run, buddy. There we go. You know what? Staravia, you're a king. You're a queen, actually, you're a female. The queen of the team, really. But, we are not a matriarchal team, so don't think a monarch. I don't know. What's a monarch? What's the difference between a matriarchal society and a monarchy? I don't know. I did it, you guys. I underestimate my team. I always do, and I need to stop doing that. Ursa Luna, poor darling. You must be exhausted from running around like that. So why was I fighting their holy bear? He's not frenzied. They, they explained it to me. I just don't remember, I'm sure. Also, if you're wondering what this is on my cup... Wait. Oh, is that focus? I don't know. Regardless, that's my brother. Um, he died last... <laughs> no, he's still alive. I just fucking hate him. <laughs> also, I don't hate him. He's, like, super cool. That's my brother. Uh, he dances like this because he's old. Except for he's younger than me, but he, like... Dance is like this, like something's wrong, and that's him on the mug. Um, I have I have here a special medicine of the Pearl Clan. It'll clear out any poison, thank goodness, in a Pokemon's body. If poison's what's causing Ursaluna's rage, this is sure to calm him down. We call it Toxigon. Blech. Oh, she, he said, that sucks. Ugh, D's nasty. It's so potent that we can only use it on tough, resilient Pokemon, like Ursaluna. There, there, dear Ursula, you've calmed down now, haven't you? I'm screaming into this mic today. I should scoot back just a little. This is all very... My headphones are fucked up. Very strange, though. He wasn't glowing. He wasn't really frenzied. Very astute of you, Galaxy Team Recruit. You're exactly right. When, you've co when you quelled Cleaver's frenzy, you could see the strange light rising into the sky all the way from here. But no such strange light erupted from Ursa Luna after you defeated him, nor was he glowing. And what is this clinging to Ursa Luna's coat? It seems like some kind of powder. That girl from the Diamond Clan. Arazu. Now, why did she of all people find the need to come and tell me about Ursa Luna, I wonder? Oh, but I almost forgot something important. Play, oh god, play your Celeste. She's going to teach me a new animal. Oh, I'm going to do something. He probably breaks boulders when I was digging around yesterday off camera i found this tunnel and i was like what's at the end of the tunnel and at the end of the tunnel was uh, a big boulder with cracks in it that clearly indicated break me and i want to break it and like every every good boy that needs to be broken we have a big bear um i'm sorry i don't like it that i said it either his claws are quivering. He's shy. Play your Celestic Flute for me, won't you? I'm sorry. I don't like it either. Uh, thumbs down this video for that alone. Give me the interaction. I dare you. That's the same song I play for my deer, though. So, like, how do they know? Why do you do that with his feet? Ursa Luna opened his heart and learned well the sound of your playing. You're... Oh, God. They... Here's the thing about these plates. Nobody shows me them being handed. Like, nobody shows me having them handed to me by these Pokemon. So what's happening here? How do they get in my hands? This is soap. 
Ursaluna is very good at finding things that are buried in the ground. How did he hand it to me? We see that he's digging for treasure, even if these treasures might not always glitter or gleam. Well, that glitter is not gold, am I right? Now go and let your commander know of what transpired here, child of the galaxy team. Brr. I like her a little bidoof. You can now call Ursaluna and dig for treasure. Where do I want to dig at? I've never seen a spot where I'm like, I could dig here. When do I get to unlock digging? Ursaluna will rush toward any treasure he senses in front of him. Press the Y button to dig for treasure when Ursaluna finds a spot that makes him react particularly strongly. You might find something very nice. How do I call him versus the other animal? Oh, look at that. I already figured it out. D-pad. So, they're probably going to bury something here. Let's try him out just to see what it's like. Oh my god, something strongly is over here. Okay, is it at this log? No. And they said Y to dig. So it's more this way. We're not ever going to do this again, unless I like have to. This is dumb. I hate this. Okay, there we go. What did I get? If it's like four potions. Old verse nine! I found the book of fucking revelations, you guys. Part of a series of old poems have been unearthed on his Sui region. Judging from the handwriting, appears they were all written by the same person. God. We'll read it. We better learn something. I set the bones of Pokemon adrift upon the river. Oh, great, a, a fucking psychopath. I let my memories flow on adrift upon the river. And to the ocean they will flow, perhaps around the world, to go. How many bones and days now gone have I set adrift for me? How many bones and days to come will I yet set adrift to see? While every gift of with which I part takes a sliver of my heart. This is dumb. Who wrote poetry and buried it in the dirt? That's my take on the Bible, too. Um, no, it's not. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Can nobody heal me up? Where am I going now? Back to camp. Um, I would love to walk there and explore and have an adventure. But I'm not doing so. You know what we're going to do? I'm not going to use them right now. But I am going to craft some revives if I have space. For I do have space right here. What the fuck? Oh, I thought these were the same thing. We're going to craft some revives. We're not going to use them. We're going to try to make it back to base. We'll use eight. Um... And then hope for the best. Because if I get into a battle, it's game over for me. But I want a hippo. I don't really want it, but I should catch a hippo. Who's attacking me? You are so incessant. Okay, fine. I won't take your hippo children. He overheard me, and I'm sorry. Oh my god, this is a minefield of fury. Okay, Max... Mad Max, I don't watch movies because they're stupid. Every single movie ever made is garbage. Um, With that said, I did see Mad Max Fury Road in theaters. Don't remember why. Don't remember who made me do it. I had a good time. It was fun. They were like screaming and spray painting their mouths. And I was like, that does seem like fun. There's an energy here that I can't describe, but I want to embody. Oh, great. I'm under attack again. All right. Do I have my Porygon? I ain't got shit. Got my bird. Tried and true. Also, I shouldn't say I ain't got shit. This is my team, and I love them all. I get my mind so focused on one or two Pokemon, and if they pass out, or if I don't have them, I think, like, oh, I'm useless. No, I've been winning battles without them. This is a very survivable world with... Oh, <gasps> Yanma? Don't mind if I do. Um, You guys know I can't pass up a Yanma. And I will in the future pass up Yanma. Because, you know, I don't need a billion Yamma. But right now, I still need some. Hello, don't mind me. Hee <laughs> hee. Ho ho, be mine. Please get caught. Oh, I told you I would tell you a Yanma story in this video, didn't I? So, I might have already said this story at some point. No, why would I say such a story? Um, so, me and somebody I used to live with, who I love very much, eh, don't worry. I learned, I don't remember how I did it. No, I did it on purpose. I would always mention Yanma around McDonald's or if we like drove by McDonald's or if we went to McDonald's. 
And then over time, I didn't do this on purpose. I don't remember. I don't remember how this, how this happened. All I know is that I kept saying Yanma around McDonald's. I realized that when I mentioned Yanma not around McDonald's, it then made him think of McDonald's. And I began to use it to my benefit where I would mention Yanma. And then in like an hour when he was like, oh, we should get McDonald's today. I'd be like, yeah, that's great that you had that idea. We should get McDonald's today. And then he would pay for it because it was his idea. And then I'd get McDonald's. Okay, where am I going? That way. How do I get over there, you guys? Oh, there's a bridge. Who knew? Do you guys think I could sneak up on that Yanma? <laughs> so, long story short, I somehow, oh my god, conditioned my boyfriend at the time to think that Yanma McDonald's, McDonald's, Yanma, hamburger, cheese, bugs, and flying air. My brain doesn't work when I'm doing two things at once. I apologize. The story's not important. Let's move away from it. If you know what I was saying, you know. If you don't, <laughs> I get it. <laughs> what is that? A radish? A soot foot root. Okay. Also root. I, I say root. I promise I don't say root. Now, is where I'm going across this bridge? Probably. I don't know. I want to see these ruins. Where are they sending me to? That's not where I initially came from, is it? My camp? Give me this root. Give me the root. Okay, that's a medicinal league. That's not a root. Okay. And then I want... I don't have many, many heavy balls left. I only have two heavy balls. And while there is a lot one can do with two heavy balls, I could use more. There we go. How many of these can I make reasonably? Let's just make 20. Okay. How many red? Ah! Oh, that's my guy. That's my, <laughs> that's my Pokemon. I thought it was under attack. Okay. Oh, rainy. Is this not where I just came from? I don't know. I get very confused. Got this. Carnivine, you don't have... I don't have space my satchel for that. Okay, I saw... Yeah, like a pile of wheat over there that I wanted, but I'll just grab this one instead, since it's on my way. Alrighty. Speaking of on your way, I live very close to a little gas station, like very close, like less than a block. And I recently learned that they carry kombucha and aloe, and I don't have to go all the way to the store for kombucha and aloe. And it's truly been, I'm so annoying, and it's truly been life-changing, is what I'm trying to say. Hi, I like that Bidoof are nice. They don't run from me, they don't attack me, they just hang out. They're chill. They're buds. They understand I'm not a threat. I'm a friend. Alright. But the ones that run, I understand. Self-preservation is important. The ones that attack? Garbage. Fix your fucking attitudes. Be grateful. Um, I'm going this way. Great, somebody's attacking me right now. Let's see. Just a bunch of bugs. Bugs and leaks. Do 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 po pee po. All right. All righty then. I say all right so much. Hello, bug. And then this is bugwort, or mugwort, bugwort. Wait, actually no. If I, I was gonna show my cricket top to the cricket, I was gonna show my cricket tune to the cricket top. I realized that would then initiate a battle. I'm gonna kick your. No, I don't have Pokemon. <laughs> I was about to say I'm gonna kick your ass. How many times do we have to keep teaching you this lesson, old man? I'm the old man, and the parasect are the lesson teachers. What is this? I can't have this. I bet I can have this. Let me make room for it. What do I have, like, you know what's dumb? Stardust. Stardust is dumb. Let it go. I don't need money. Discard. Get the fuck out of my face. Now I've got a dyer's room. Who did it? It was, it was him. You fool. Okay, well, that was very rude. And now I've been paralyzed. Not actual. What is that? Oh, that's just a <laughs> on the side of my screen. The paint that indicates I took damage. I thought it was like an apparition. Okay, can I heal up? I'm gonna get fall damage if I'm not careful. Ow, my knees. I'm seven. My knees do not hurt. Hey, can you heal me? I love you. I like that when it rains in this game, everything looks like it's made out of plastic. I could use a rest. I truly could. Just a little while.
Now, I believe there are Pokemon that I caught that I wanted to put in my team. So let's see what that's all about. Yeah, Yanma! I would like to see my Pokemon. Okay, so Yanma's probably going to have to replace Krikatoon. Now, which one's a boy and highest level? 23, 20... And you might be looking at stats instead of level. I don't know how stats work, so I'm looking at... Oh, God, they're all girls, so it's the one boy I'm going to keep. All right. Now, he replaces... He has to replace Krikatoon, I guess. I'm not a fan of Beeble usually, but like he really has been an OG. I do have to keep him. Cricketune only knows absorb and tackle. Cricketune, I think you'll be happier in the pasture. Now, don't that doesn't mean I'm killing you. Like I'm literally putting you in the pasture, I guess. Yanma! He's on my team. I'm so happy. <laughs> also, I can name Pokemon. I think I told you that before. But I don't have names ready for you guys yet, so. We will wait. Where am I going? You want me to go to the Scott God? Oh, that's just back to the town. Put it a little lower. What? Would you come? I was just over there. If you needed me, you should have spoken to me then. What? Oh, see, I think you've got something stuck to you. Is it my Yanma? <gasps> a. Hi, this is very cute. No, 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 no. Come back. I love you. I'm the runes of Alf. I'm the new runes of Alf. I carry the unknown. Was that a Pokemon? It was. It was a very cute one. Come to think of it, Volo. I love Volo. You know Volo Leventon? Let's gossip. Have you seen his hair? He's so pretty. <laughs> Volo did mention that there were carvings that resembled writing on the walls of the Solacian runes. But supposing that the Pokemon we just saw is a species with multiple forms, perhaps the carvings are... Wow, you deduced that one correctly, but wildly. You do not have nearly enough information to come to that conclusion. With that said, good job. All my math teachers to me when I didn't show my work. Perhaps the carvings are actually likenesses of this very Pokemon. I'm going to add a section specifically for that species to your Pokedexia. Thank you. My lips are dry. Unknown notes were added to your Pokedex. All right, can I go to town now? What's this now? Letter-like markings seem to have appeared in this section I've just added. And was that your arse phone I just heard? If your mysterious device is reacting to this new species, I wonder what that could mean. They're weirdly, like, I don't know, like, they're, like, mythical and shit. Like, the unknown in, like, the movie were, like, oh! I, they they like create the fabric of the universe or something. Do you remember that movie with uh, who's that fire dog? Intei, in the unknown. Suicun might have been there. I don't know. What's the electric one ever doing? Nothing. He's dumb. Okay, Raiku, Reiki, Reiki massage. Press the Y button while viewing the cover of your Pokedex to jump to your unknown research notes. By deciphering the cryptic symbols found in these notes, you can try to find all the unknown hiding throughout the region. These unknown possess a mysterious power that repels Pokeballs containing Pokemon, so you won't be able to battle them. But track them down and... <gasps> Alphabet Soup, the game? So I open my Pokedex with down, and then I press Y. Oh, look at him in the corner. Yeah, okay, indicating where I press it. God. Oh. Tion, I don't know. With... Within the something where the poles where time rules within the settlement where time rules. Okay, so do you think unknown? are easier to read for dyslexic people or an absolute curse for dyslexic people? Because I'm not dyslexic. I'm stupid. There's a major difference. Um, huh. Okay, do you want my research notes? I probably have things to report. Yes, I would like to report my findings. So we're going to seek out unknowns at some point, but right now we're going to continue along with the story. I didn't catch that much interesting shit, except for Porygon! Oh, I got health money for that one, too. I'd be making money. Let's go talk to the guy that expands my inventory stuff. 
because that's truly what I need. Oh, Sam, you've made some new observations. Let's have a look then. I don't need to see all this. Most illuminating. You say the same thing every time. Woohoo, thanks. Alrighty. Give me another rank. Oh, I'm already ready for the next rank. I believe you're ready to move through. I'm so ahead of the game. Best report to... Yes, I will get there. Return to the village. All right. Going up a level. Going to add some expansion to my space. Expanding. What am I saying? Add some space to my pockets. Expand my satchel. I don't like that she acts like we're friends now because we are not. I will not forget how rude you were to me. And I also just don't like you in general. I, you talk about politics too much, Akari. I can't do it. Like, it's not that serious. There's like four of us living here. I'll get there. Leave me alone. The person that expands my satchel, if you'll remember, does live or does reside in this building. So, hey, 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 hey. Oh, you're not Volo. Rare wares. I would like to buy, but you're not Volo. Do you guys know Volo? Are you Volo's dad? Ginter. Okay, what are you selling? Oh, you are fine too. What are they drinking in that Gink guild or Ginko? Man, look. <whistles> Damn. I'm going to look at that girl in a second too. A feather ball set. Yours for the bargain price of 2500 What is it you ask? Well, that's for you to find out. Ah, the excitement. They said mystery box. No. Except for yes, because you're hot. Okay, fine. 30? Ooh, that's a pretty good deal, I think. Ooh, they're cute. A ball that flies fast and true. Ideal for catching nimble Pokemon or Pokemon that fly high in the air. Okay. What's this catch rate like? Is it the same as a Pokeball? Won't be long before your our next great find. Come again soon. God, he's fine. Whose grandpa is this? God damn. All right. Now let's see grandma. Grandma, what you about? She's cute. They didn't go through as much effort in her design. I think that's sexist. A fine day to you, my friend. Or maybe I'm just like, I will accept the most basic of men as like, and I require too much of women. And that's sexist on me. So you know what? Uno reverse card back on me. You're right, game freak. I'm a terrible person. Care to pursue our top notch selection of rarities? The Ginkgo Guild cart sells items you won't find at general store. Ooh, okay. Um, I can forage for all of these. And I don't mean to be like, uh, I could make that, but I, I can make that. So I won't. Right, she's kind of like... No, she's... Hmm. They don't seem like they're... They seem like they're related more so than, like, old man and old wife. But I don't know, she just kind of looks like everybody else. Maybe he does, too. Maybe I just have an eye for men. Well, <laughs> that's not a surprise. Um, We know that. Hey, bud, how are you and... Wah, wah, wah. He still hasn't evolved. But you don't have to evolve him if you don't want to. I just I just thought you wanted to evolve him, is all. Alright, so you expand my shit. Yeah? And I mean my satchel. Teach me. Okay, we're gonna do this... Oh, quite a few of these. But not too many, because I know it like doubles in price each time, and that's gonna add up. But I would like quite a few of these. And like, what else do I need money for? Other than this. And feather ball surprise boxes from hot grandpas. I'll buy like one more. Maybe two. No, because two's going to be ten. Woo! Yeah, I'm going to buy one more. Oh, it's only 3,000. Wait a minute. It doesn't double each time. Maybe it does. Maybe I just can't do math. I don't know why I thought 1,500 times two is 5,000. How much is it this time? No, it just goes... Okay, you know what? It's not doubling each time. Okay. I'll buy one more if it's... F Actually, let's keep 10,000. 10,000 feels like a safe... A safe place to reside financially. I'm going to Silene, actually. Because I ranked up, my dear... Oh, you're not Silene. That's the board of jobs, tasks, and chores. And I'm not here for... Hi, Abra. How are you today, Silene? I ranked up. Yes, yes. There's my Pokemon. Give me Togepi! When do I get a Togepi, you guys? Progress. Da, 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 da. Thank you. I'm a street. I'm a three-star little boy. Three out of ten. With this, you have officially attained the rank of third star. 
Great balls. Okay, so there we go. Level 40. Okay. Great balls. Oh, I got a recipe. Apricorn, iron, and tumble. I think I have plenty of iron. And I get plenty of apricorn tumble stone. This will be great. These are easy enough to make. Cool. Now it'll be easier to catch Pokemon. Now, where is their catch rate compared to the heavy balls? I don't know. Let's go upstairs, though. We gotta talk to Dad. I, Because Captain Kamado and Silene... Like, Silene's not a captain. People say, go see the captain, and I think of Silene. I always forget about my dad up top here. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. There's only three men that I'm a love in my whole life. It's my daddy and Sonic and this green guy. I love. Okay, I'm very happy that some of my favorite people have all gathered in one room. I don't understand your gray beard with the rest of your hair being green. I also don't understand that you're like old, but you look young. It's very shocking. It's not shocking. It's very confusing. See, we have a situation here. Oh, God. Benny. What? No mushrooms? No mochi? No more potatoes? Let me explain. Lilligent. Our clan's Lady of the Ridge is an oath. There's that frenzy again. And Arezu knowingly kept this from me. What is a Lilligent? Yes. There, there are only fem female Lilligent, which makes this honored one our Lady of the Ridge. But this isn't the time for cultural lessons. I'd like to find out just what Arezu was thinking, but she's nowhere in Jubilife Village. Who's Arezu? I met her. Is that the old lady? No, she had a fun name. Who's Arezu? Last I saw, she was at the Wallflower, polishing off a... This is all we ever do around here, you guys. Not that I blame her, my cooking is simply irresistible after all. If a Rezu of the Diamond Clan was somehow involved in that situation with the raging Ursaluna of the Pearl Clan, it could lead to the two clans going at each other's throats again. Tell me, Commander, if we do end up in a struggle with the Pearl... Who is this girl we're talking about? A Rezu? Is she trying to cause war? That's not good. We don't support that. We can struggle with the Pearl Clan. What will your people do? God, he's so fine! We would be forced to remain neutral. Meaning what? If we were to show support for one side, it would put us at odds with the other. We came here to create a ho what a home for ourselves, not to take part in tearing the land apart. Right, of course. After all the work you've put in to get us to treat one another as equals and keep getting us from fighting, I suppose it's no surprise you'd refuse to intervene if trouble were to break out again. I love being part of the neutral party. I do like that. Because I ain't give a fuck about either, except for I love the blue clan, the Sonic clan. So actually, I'm not neutral. I love him. I have favorites, and it's Sonic. Fuck me. See, uh, perhaps you have some idea how we might address the situation. I could call Ursaluna. What would that do? Ursaluna? So he and Warden Calaba found you worthy? That's perfect then. Ursaluna should be able to sniff out Arezu wherever she's gone. Who is Arezu? Have I not met her? Maybe I haven't met her. If you are strong enough that Ursaluna deemed you worthy, then you should be ready to quell Lilligen's frenzy as well. If it's a real frenzy, I'll head to Lilligen's seat. Then Brave Arena is... I'll, <laughs> I'll head to Lilligen's seat then. Brave Arena it's called, if you'll excuse me. Thank you. I'll be your seat. Um, listen well, Sia, I'm sorry. You must quell any Pokemon that could cause harm to the people of his sea. Always remember, we came here to make a new home where we could live without war or strife. Okay, thanks. Um, you, what was that you said about not tearing the land apart? Flashbacks of me attacking trees and throwing Pokemon at stones and, like, <laughs> violently attacking Pokemon in the wild? Yeah, sure. Okay, so I'm going out here. For what? So I can call the bear? Oh, yeah, we're gonna sniff at- Oh, they're gonna make me use the sniffing feature! I don't want to sniff! Back out here we go. You are so fine, may God love you. And you are so cute! May Satan keep his claws off of you. Um, do I need to do anything in town? Yes. Yes, I do, y'all. 
I need to empty my pockets. Uh, where? It's in here. Okay. Anything that I only have like one of can go. Where did I get all of these? Move to item storage. Move to item storage. Grit dust. Don't I get this last? Where do I keep getting this dust? Grit gravel. Oh, that's gravel. I'll put those in there too. I'll use them one day, I promise, because they're actually like a useful item, it seems. Oh wait, this can revive Pokemon? I use these to make revives. I want to clear out more pocket space than I have. Oh, but I got one, two, three, four, five. Then you know what? We're going to survive like this. Feather balls. No Pokemon will eat it. I, I don't know how to make anything out of bug wart, so get out of here. What's this little guy? I don't know what that's for. So get out of here. All right. Let's go call the bear. Did y'all read Call of the Wild by Jack London? I didn't, but I had a copy of it. One year I got a really nice copy of it for Christmas from my aunt and uncle that always give us really nice gifts that we were too young to like really appreciate. And now as an adult, I'm like, wow, that was a really nice gift. And just wondering if you ever read Call of the Wild, because I didn't. So I'm going here. But where am I going here? J just to call a bear and sniff out a woman? Do we have a panty sample for him to work off of, or like, are we are we going blind? That girl who set out earlier must have been eaten. I'm sorry. I need to go jerk off after this video or something. I don't know what my issue is today. Um, then eating some of Benny's potato mochi. I could still smell them on her. Why? Sorry. Smell them on her. That rem <laughs> I'm not really sorry, you guys. That reminds me. I've. Because, like, what? I can say whatever I want, wherever I want. Welcome to YouTube. I said a terrible thing. I'm not the only one here doing it. <laughs> I've seen Mistress Kalaba riding around on Ursaluna as she serves, digging for treasure in the ground. I wonder if Ursaluna uses his sense of smell to suss out treasure, where treasure might be. Now knows Rezu sent. Follow the blue signals to find her. Blue signals. Okay. So, he... All right, so I'm just gonna, oh, okay, but I'm following blue. That was not blue. I'm afraid of falling in the water. I'm just looking at my signal. I'm not really thinking about it. It's blue this way. Okay, and then go this way. Arezu. Okay, it's getting, it's getting, getting stronger. I don't like this feature. <gasps> is that a Togepi? No, what is that? That's a Togepi, you guys. That is fully a Togepi. In the ground. He's sleeping. Is that how Togepi sleep? You guys, that's... <laughs> right? That's not Togepi. Okay. Nope, not Togepi. I'm a fool. It's a vivid choke. I've seen a hundred of them in the game so far. Right. Okay. Well, moving forward. Where's this girl? Well, there's no blue lines here. I have to get up here. But I can't get up there because... Oh my god, he he can climb actually decent better than I can. Okay, well, good to know he can climb. <gasps> Tangela or Tangela. They must not see very well because I just stampeded up here. Hello, please be mine. <gasps> please don't see that and get scared. Thank you. Okay. Ah! Oh, they're friendly. Do you want to be my friend? Hi! Hi! <gasps> Hi! You're very cute. I like that they ran right up to me. Okay. I might as well get that third one while I'm here. They're friendly. That's nice, because you don't see very many friendly Pokemon. Like, other than Bidoof, I can't name another one other than now Tangela. Okay. Ever the friend. Okay. Back on my bear. Man, I hate that I'm exploring without, like... Like, I'm going fast and, like, not really seeing the environment. Is that fucking Onyx? Onyx is my best friend's favorite Pokemon. If I catch that, he'll be... Is that Onyx? Okay. Oh, my God. He's not. I'm not going to deal with him right now. Hey, there's somebody. Well, now that I know where the person is, maybe I could go get the Onyx. I'm going to talk to this person. Hello. 
I'm here to bother you. Apparently you're... Oh, I met you. You're the hair cutter. I thought you were nice. Are you evil? Oh, Sia, how did it all go with Earth? Well, you lied. He's not frenzied. You're a clown. You look like Team Magma. You're so cool looking, though. What's up? I calmed him down. Wow, you really are strong. But how'd you find me all the way out here? I sniffed you. From the potato mochi, I'll say. You followed the scent of the potato mochi I bought at the Wallflower? Man, I wish I could eat some more of those right now. Jubilee Village. Oh, I'm so hungry. <laughs> I'm so excited to eat after this video. I'm sure it was a lot of fun. My luck's run out, though, as you can most likely tell. I got chased by a Pokemon and sprained my... Yeah, you sprained your ankle. You're gonna die. Let me give you some grit dust. Rub it in there. Come on, get up, sis. Sprained my ankle pretty bad as I was running away. It's almost like the world wants to punish me. Ha! Ah! There you are. A Rezu, right? Eek! What, you afraid of the old lady? M Mistress Calib- I, I didn't- I owe you an apology. I treated you with disrespect, thinking you were just some whelp from the Diamond Clan. I'm sorry for that. I should have treated you better. Huh? Wait, but... It's not your fault that Lilijim became frenzied, nor that my Ursaluna was so enraged. You were trying to help them both, weren't you? Was she? I didn't even have the courtesy to listen to you. You'd think someone who's lived as long as I have would be more patient. No, bitch, you're on your way out. You don't have a lot of time left. Go, go, go. Do not be patient. It's okay, I didn't do a good... Which is why they should drive faster. Old people, start driving faster. You don't have time left. Go! I didn't do a good job explaining myself either. Ursaluna only started acting weird after he got too close to Lilija and smelled her perfume. She was already frenzied by that point, so I'm sure that's what caused it. Ah, that explains the strange powder I found on Ursaluna. It must have been powder from a Lilijan. But what happened to your leg, dear? I was gathering ingredients to make bombs. Oh god, we're gonna have to throw bombs again. But I fell and sprained my ankle. It's a sprained ankle. Walk. Right? Am I wrong? You have one good leg. <laughs> get up. See, the reason I went to Jubilife was to get help from Ursaluna and also learn about crafting. Oh, they'll teach you about crafting there. It's about all they'll talk about there. But while I was there, I bumped into Professor Laventon and he told me about the bombs he used to quell Cleaver. So I thought I'd make some for Lilijan using her favorite foods. You galaxy people know all sorts of things. I'd like to learn even more from you, really. <gasps> hey, bitch! Can we... Hey, girls, cover your ears. When they're gone, do you want to, like, fuck out here, like, under the tree as the sun goes down? I promise not to call you Sonic during sex. I'll remember that your name is Adaman. Hmm? Hmm? I don't know. Let me know. Well, then we'd better take care of our lady and get all this mess resolved first. Adaman. What were you thinking, doing this all yourself? Did you think I couldn't help you? Though no one would blame you for thinking so. Not much of a leader, am I? I've never even seen Almighty Sinnoh with my own- Has anybody? Other than me, of course. And I failed to imagine that Lilligent might have become frenzied too. Listen up, Sia. I'll take the bombs that Arezu made and meet you at Brava Arena. Don't you worry, Arezu. Sia will calm Lilligent, and that will be that. Things should settle, settle down. Is it Lilligent? I think it's Lilligent. Head to Brave Arena, Sia. That's where Lilligent's seat lies. Ereza will be taken care of. My dear Bibarol, it is Bibarol. And I will make sure she reaches her lady. Oh, oh god. She got right on that. Glad to see it. All right. Ooh. Oh, that's not very far. Not very far of a trek ahead of us. Let's knock this tree. Grab this. All right, and with that, I'm going to end this video. Ooh, a rock! See, this is what I mean. There's clearly rocks that are breakable in this game. We're going to go quell Lilligent at her seat next time, I guess. And find a fucking Togepi one day uh, That I don't, that's not a vivid choke. All right, bye. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 no. I have been wanting now, whatever.